welcome back uh, to my channel. This is, my name is Jackie, and today I'm doing a little keto low carb plan with me for the week. Um, in anyone for those who asked last week, this is my glitter dory. It's an A5 traveler's notebook. Yes, it's super glitzy. Um, I'll leave a, a link to Charlie Charlie's Magpie where I get it from below, and a code um, she very kindly gave. So this was last week. Um, I didn't do very well, if I'm honest. I did okay um, up until sort of Thursday night. Um, I went. I had a really bad problem last week with sleeping, and I was waking up exhausted. And I was actually an hour and a half late for work one day. I just really struggled with my energy levels uh, because of that. So um, my fitness really I only actually did one lot of fitness last week. Um, which was I went on Tuesday, but I ended up doing all the machines. So I did do that, but the rest of the week was just a bit much of a write-off, exercise-wise. Um, water, vitamins, and keeping on track was well, again not good. Water I didn't do. I just cannot get into the rhythm of drinking water again. My vitamins I did three out of four, three out of seven. Sorry, I just keep forget. And I have to set an alarm. And staying on track, say, I just didn't do it very well. Um, I did have these every day, so that was cool. Um, and um, my eating, I did have Spanish chicken a couple of times. I had a really nice salad as well. Uh, so I actually had that extra. Um, but yeah, and I did have the gel phrase, and I'm having a roast dinner today. So it's, I would give myself a three out of ten for last week. Also, um... I hurt myself in some way. I don't know what I did, but I pulled um, um, a muscle in my like my rib. So I'm gonna put in my weight for last week. Uh, I pulled some sort of muscle in my rib, and it, it was actually hurting to breathe uh, on my right side. I don't know what I did. I don't know if I did it at the gym or I did one day at the gym. Um, or what I did, but it's actually I can still feel it, feel it now. And it started on sort of thurs, Thursday, today's Sunday. So I don't know what I did, but it's really painful. Um, but even when I breathe deeply, so and that was my way in. Not good. Um, just need to crack on with it again this week. So yes, not perfect, but it's better than nothing. So moving on to this week. I think today is going to be the 13th. Let's put some stuff down. Okay. I've got these boxes here from Mimi's Mayhem. They don't fit on in this um, planner, but they're pretty nice. So I'm going to use them. These like purples and gold colours. So I'm going to go for... there um and away different for the weekend so i'm going to leave the saturday and sunday clear i'll put those to one side for a moment i may come back to those so what my plan is is as i've got a new swimming costume is try to do some swimming now wednesday thursday friday we're down to two members of staff so I think the best I'm going to get on a Wednesday and Friday is a swim. So I've got my Plump Planner swimming, st swimming stickers. Um, so let's go with green. I'm going to pop that in there. And I'll go for another green actually. So that's going to be, I think, Friday as well. I think. Oh, there is another there's a, a, a possibility that the other member of staff I'm, I'm working with for three days may actually also be off. So I will literally be on my own in an office covering the workload of four people. Um, then, so we've got gym days. I'm going to attempt Monday and Tuesday for gym because there's more staff. So I should be able to get my time. So I'm going to go for blue. I'm going to go for the pink. And what I'm going to do on the Monday... I'm going to go for um, nice pen. Monday, I'm going to go for um, kettlebells. So let's just 
let's use this nice pink one. Tuesday, I'm going to go for machines. I mentioned last week what that looks like. Well, I'm not going to keep running out every week. I'll optimistically say on Thursday that I'll do something. Um, so what I'll do for that one is grab another sheet. I'm going to just grab these little shoes from Lucinda Charlotte. I'm just going to try and just do cardio at lunchtime. Um, I also do cardio with these as well. When I go to the gym, I don't just do kettlebells or machines. I also do uh, cardio as well. So let's just do cardio. Let's see how we go. Yeah, before work or at lunchtime, we'll see. And then Saturday and Sunday are rest days. So, because I'm just so busy at home doing other things. So that's that. Right. So... Let's do this week's um, food during the day. I've got these Chelsea Paper Co. flags. Um, and uh, I've got a discount for Chelsea Paper Co., which is Planner 10. I'll leave a link to her shop below. I'm going to go for these really little cute rain clouds on these little... I, I like these as well. So I'm going to go for the pink and these because they're sweet. Um, yeah, that'd be cool. So... I don't remember actually how much what my snacks are. I did not last week do my freezer audit, but I have, however, um, used some of my freezer food. So I'm pretty happy about that. This um, is like my um, side food, as it were. Um, so um, but I eat during, I just graze throughout the day, basically. So I know that I've got, uh, this week is pecan nuts, 20 grams. Um, I've got uh, just cooked chicken breast. I've got a deal on those. Skinless that is actually. I've got some, just some cheese. Portions. Um, I'm having chia pudding, which I probably has more of my breakfast. Um, so that's chia seed pudding. Um, which is like chia seed soaked in um, almond milk. I use almond milk. Um, and then um, some people put like a bit of chocolate in it and microwave it once it's all soaked up and have like a chocolate pudding. But I've got some sugar-free um, syrups um, from Skinny Syrup Company. And I've got all different. I've got pineapple. I've got s'mores flavors. So I'll do um, a chia pudding. Um, pecans are about mm, about three net carbs. I'm guessing zero for the chicken. Cheese is pretty much zero. Chia pudding is going to be about three, um, and I've got some. Bah, 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 um, I've got some meat stick things. Meat stick. I think it's like one gram, and I'm also going to put in my coffee and things for the day. So I make with cream and I put MCT oil in it to get the, the fat levels up. Um, I'll probably spend about four grams of my carb allowance on coffee with cream in it. So there is those. So that's three, six, um, seven. That's 11 grams of carbs, give or take. On that. There you go. So there's that there. And then I've got my evening meals. Oh. Actually, I've almost forgot. I've got a very cute prepare oat sticker. It's not um, a chia pudding. There's not going to be a chia pudding sticker, but I just thought this was cute. So I'm going to use this prepare oat sticker from Little Poor Plants. I'm just going to pop that there because it's cute. 
why not? And oh, I've got a coffee sticker as well. Let's put that there because I can. So there's that done. So moving on to my mills. almost forgot this which is a little cute take lunch sticker I think this is plum planner looks like her stuff um, but I'm just gonna put that there little take take lunch sticker why not so there's that there so my meals week I've been did a lot of meal prep today today's Sunday and uh, so I've done my meal prep um, and I've prepped um, two things I've pre prepped some prawns and some smoked salmon just chopped it up mixed it up um, seasoning and I'm going to do some salad so I'm going to do a prawn and salmon salad uh, I'll probably do that Tuesday and because I can't freeze it obviously I'm going to probably do that on Tuesday and Thursday I've also put in my slow cooker um, some lamb. Um, so slow cooker lamb, it's got a lot of calories in it proportion. I worked out to be about five. And um, so it's like um, lamb slow cooker. That's, um, I've worked it out to be like 800 and something calories, <laughs> about 800 calories. Um, and um about four carbs to be fair of um of yeah four carbs and we're gonna have that with um cauliflower rice cauliflower rice has got about seven the lamb's got i say about i can say about four So on that day, I'll be having 11, so that's like 22. I give myself a bit of flexibility. Sometimes I want more. Um, probably want jelly and cream for dessert because I've got it. Um, prawn salad, um, probably looking at about seven with all the greenery. I'll put some cheese in it. Uh, Saturday, Friday, I'll have kebab from takeaway because I just want to cook. I never cooked my jalfrezi um, this week and I still got my paste. So I am going to cook jalfrezi on Saturday and I'll cook enough for leftovers. Um, so I'll do a jalfrezi and on Sunday, I don't know yet, I haven't thought far ahead, I'll probably just do a roast again because it will give me a leftovers. Um, so there is that. And habits I'm going to track for the week. I'm going to, I've got to get on my water. It's really bad. Um, I mean, I'm hungrier than usual doing this plan. So I think part of it is because I'm not drinking my water. Will this fit on? I might drop off a little, little example glasses of water on here. Just to remind me what water looks like. I forget what water looks like. There we go. Um, so water, my vitamins again. I'm just staying on track. It's going to be a very stressful week next week with the staffing levels we've got and um, workload that I'm going to have because of it. So I know that um, I'm going to struggle doing maintaining myself, my mental health. I think. Um, let's put that on there. Let's get rid of. Let's put that on there. Why not? So this week, I did look at a class actually, um, which was um, the kettlebell class itself, rather than just doing it myself. So I think um, I will look at that. To see um, 
what it's like and how intense it is. But it's on a, I think it's on a Wednesday night. So I think I may um, sign myself up for that. So that's positive. But I need to just download the, um, the program for my gym. Just for a little effect. So, um, put it there, why not? So download. class plan but I think that's pretty much the only one that's going to appeal to me at the moment there's that there and on Sunday I've got my little stickers here I'm going to say might as well Put, let's use a little let's use this is from dream big and plan let's use this yellowy one this is just dinner labels so I do have some meal prep stickers but I can't find them so I'm not sure I've got a tin of mustard greens I've never tried them um, so that might be something I need to think about, mustard greens. Let's put that down as an idea. I need to find out what they taste like. I bought them from an the ethnic um, shop, a Pakistani shop, and I asked the man, what do these taste like, how do I cook them? And he went, I don't know, my wife does. So she wasn't there. So I don't know how what to do with them, which taste nice. So I don't know. Um, so I'm going to put a little thing there and a cute little cup. Saturday I'm actually out but I can meal plan. Um, while I'm there. While I'm travelling. Cute little get it done sticker, get it done. I think I'm just gonna pop this down here. Get it done. There. And the little doodah for the week. Mm -mm -mm. I would, I'm in, I've had a little sneak and I think I've just maintained this week. So no actual progress. I'm very sorry for the disappointment. It's not been a good, not been a good time. It's not going to be good next week, but I'll do my best. So I've got a nice little sheet of my positive um, sayings from the Ginger Cat Co. Let's go with... Mm, stay strong. Positive pants are on. I don't feel really on right now, if I must admit. I feel a little bit deflated, but I'm going to keep going. Positive pants are on. There we go. So, mostly low carb, a little bit keto, whatever way you look at it. Um, I do have um, try to increase that. Like this lamb, for example, is so fatty. Um, I also added MCT oil to bump my fat levels up. So, um, I'm looking really um, between sort of 20 and 30 grams of carbs a day, which all this would give me. I give myself a little bit of flexibility in case I'm particularly hungry, time of the month, all that stuff, energy levels. Um, I've got protein shakes, I've got um, low carb bars. I can fall back on, I can just grab some meat. So um, yeah, so that is pretty much where I am. Um, hope that helps anybody out there. If you've got any comments or questions, please feel free to include them below. And fingers crossed and I'll see you next week.